Hey guys, this week for our mentor sentence, we are reading um, a chair for my mother, which you guys listened to for the read aloud yesterday. Our sentence is every day when my mother comes home from work, I take down the jar. All right, we're going to look at telling and declarative sentences this week. So we're going to talk about the difference between using a period. Um, we also know that we can use an exclamation point and a question mark. Um, so we're going to talk about how we know to use a period. Um, and we're also going to talk about the nouns, the verbs, adjectives that we see in the sentence and other punctuation. We see a comma, a period. We notice that our sentence begins with a capital letter like all of our sentences should. But for today, I want you guys to look at our rule, our um, phonics rule, which is the U-R-E-N-A-I-R. -E so you will see the A-I-R in the word chair. So U-R-E, a word with U-R-E in it hat ends with a your sound like you'll see you are e at the end of temperature and a i r like in chair would make the air sound so a r a i r by itself like the air is spelled this way so your and air are the two phonics rules that we're learning so you know that when you see these in a sentence that that's the sound that they're going to make when you see these three letters together. So your job for today is to read your paragraph. This paragraph is posted in your um, discussion for today. And you're going to find all of the U-R-E and A-I-R words that you can find in it in the discussion. And tomorrow we will spend some time talking about telling and declarative sentences.